Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install and download the friend or foe mod onto XR Auton, or you can do it on Eternos, it's your choice. So to get started, you want to come to this page, you can find the link down in the description below. And so you want to go down here to featured versions, press see all, and then here are all the versions. So you can select whatever version you want. Um, what we use for our friend or foe is we use this one right here. It's the most up to date with our version 1.20.1. So I'm going to be using this as the example. So you want to go over here and click download. So you also need to go and install the Fabric API mod for this. You need to find the one for 1.20.1, and that should be right here. I think this is the most up to date. So you want to download it once again. Um, my downloads are here in Chrome. It should be over here. Edge, I think the same. And then you want to head over to XR Auton or Eternos. It's basically the same thing. They look basically the same. So I'm going to be using Darkenville for testing. So you want to make sure you go to software, you go to fabric, and you find the latest version for 1.20.1 or whatever version you use 1.20.1, 2, 3, 4, 5, whatever you think works the best. But with the one I installed, you need this one right here. You want to make sure you press install. All right, and then you should see this mods folder pop up. But you don't want to go there. You want to go to files, and then you want to head over to mods. Then you want to press upload, and you want to press files. And then you want to do these two you're gonna press open they should be downloading there we are so first you want to start your server I'm not gonna be logging on to the game to show you guys what to do in game it's pretty self-explanatory I'm pretty sure it shows the commands on the other page for the download so once it finishes starting you're gonna stop it again after that yeah so you want to stop it I know you just spend the time making sure it's starting but you want to start it and make sure it's finished saving then the config you should see fourth config, click it, and if you want to edit anything, you can do so. In our friend or foe, what we do is we change this to lives, etc. You can do whatever you want here. You can uh, change this where, you know, when someone runs out of lives, they can be in spectator mode. But um, th we left it generally the same. You can change the times for when PvP is on and all the other things. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. The mod will be down in the description down below. Uh, all credit to I Like Food for this mod. And I will see you all for the next video. Goodbye, everybody.